Hey guys, it's Joby and welcome back to my channel. So look, I've been thinking about if I should even make this video for like the last couple of days because everyone else has been talking about Boosie. Um, but I was on live a little while ago and I saw something else came out about Boosie and it just sparked me and said, you know what? F this, I'm going to make the video. So before we get into how much of a bad father, okay, Boosie badass is, um, please don't forget to like this video. Okay. Like it now, like it later. Just like the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm Jovi beauty. I'm Jovi beauty on all platforms. So please follow, please subscribe all that good, good stuff. And, um, now let's get on with this damn story. So before we even get on to what the attorney general is saying about Boosie, yes, the attorney general child, before we even get into what the attorney general is currently saying about Boosie, let's get into the fact that a couple of days ago, I don't know if he said it a couple of days ago or somebody dug up an old recording, child, I don't know, but he basically said that he had uh, some chick, okay, suck off his 12, 11, you know, something like that sons. Um, and nephews because he don't want them to be gay. He gives them an iPhone 11 so they can watch Pornhub. All of this foolishness that this motherfucker. Um, okay, let me not let me say, say MF -er before I get hit. But anyway, um, let me first say that this has been this has been going on for a while. Boosie had like really been attacking homosexuality. And let me just say, I'm I'm not homosexual. I'm not, you know, whatever. But I always find it interesting when men are so preoccupied with homosexuality, okay? Men, I feel like a lot of these men who be so angry at it, so whatever at it, those be the ones who be secretly doing the DL stuff. Them, them be the ones who be secretly doing too damn much and, and are really... It's like, you know, like even with Caucasian men, a lot of them, you know, homophobic tendencies. It's like it's a lot of the times it's like they don't want to acknowledge a lot of shit. They see it with them themselves. OK, let me just say that. I'm not saying that Boosie takes it in, the, uh, but I'm just saying, huh, you know, um, it's child molestation. Everybody keep talking about someone needs to call. BCW, CPS, whatever it is in Atlanta, I don't know, on Boosie and get his kids taken away. But when, who is calling? Everyone keeps saying that when none of y'all motherfuckers is calling, okay? I'm not from Atlanta. I live in New York. It is thoroughly traumatic for a little boy for that stuff to happen to him. Now, he may not realize it at the time. I know little, I know boys, I know men. OK, that had that shit happen to them, you know, and at the time it was so cute. It was so whatever. But it it's damaging. OK, it's damaging. And it caused it caused really dramatic, belittling, disgusting effects. You know, those are the men who who, in my opinion, men who do shit like that, who, you know, were were opened to sexuality and sex at like 10 or 11 you know those age some older woman taking advantage of them because that's what it was it was some older woman taking advantage of them via instructions from their father or uncle or whatever you know when those those are the men who can't associate sex with women they just associate it like some animal like some animal um like some like 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 animal lust Right. They really don't like women because a woman is the one who molested them. And those be the ones who turn out to, you know, be be willing and able to have sex and put their dicks in anything, including men, including other men. OK, so if you're trying to say I'm you know, I'm getting my son's pee pee sucked at 11 so he'll turn around and won't be gay. Um, that'll probably make him gay. That'll probably make him really hate women. If you comprehend anything about psychology, that is what happens. You have to let these children do what they do. You have to let them live. Let your kids watch cartoons. It's not that deep. Why do you want to, why do you want to fuck up the mentality of your children? Okay. Those are the children who he, who will grow up to either be trash or low key homosexual themselves. Okay. 
Don't do shit like that. It's horrible. It's effed up. And, you know, it's just disgusting. It's just disgusting. Those men are so fucking damaged. If you, if you, ladies and gentlemen, if you know men like this who happen, who that's something who is that has happened to them, it doesn't surprise you when you found when you find out based off of how the man acts, based off how the man treats people, based off how the man treats women or and think of women. You always know when a nigga was taken advantage of when he was really young by some old ass woman, by some old 18 year old, 19 year old chick trying to suck off some little eight, some little eight year old, nine year old, 10 year old's penis. Boosie should be ashamed of himself. Fuck ashamed. Boosie should put, be put in jail. Okay, that's it. His children should be taken away from him. But nonetheless, let's continue on. So all of this shit is happening. <laughs> He he got he getting his sons molested and stuff, according to him. And he is not taking care of his daughter. He has a whole daughter and he has not provided for her one bit. What the hell is happening? What is going on? Listen, we know you ain't making record sales like that. We know you ain't doing it like that. Maybe if you were less caught up in sex and trying to get a nut and more caught up in trying to get this bag, you could be able to properly take care of your kids. Okay, I'm done.